Hi everybody! Welcome to Crafting Journey with Rebecca. This is my channel and you are in my studio for a fantastic unboxing. Now, these two are from Treasure Studios Arts. They came together in a um, like a bag type packaging and I do want Rachel to see um, what is happening here with the packaging. I'm mean, like this is literally the way it came. It is beat all to hell. I'm not kidding you. I mean, look at this. You know, it's just really beat up. It, you know, it's it's open. Um, this one's pretty beat up as well. Hopefully, these boxes, that bag, did their job. Okay, we're gonna take the big, the big, big, big one off to the side. Oh my gosh, it's it's huge. I'm trying not. It's spilling everywhere, guys. Ah. <laughs> All right. What is in here? Now, I'm just gonna say, you guys know, I love Alice in Wonderland. Yes, no secret, no secret. Okay. This is how the box came, Rachel. I'm so sorry. Um, it is really beat up. I think she sent it DHL and then it went to the post office after that. It had a long journey, let's just put it that way, from China here to the US. So here is the toolkit. It's actually in another bag. But let's take it out, let's show you. So my paintings are square. I, I chose uh, TSA squares. I, I like to do squares, guys. It's just me. So what do we have in the toolkit? We have the larger, it's a, a glitter pin with a probably a 10 placer. Uh, attached. We have a boat with a funnel, a uh, couple of pieces of wax there, and we have, okay, we have a squishy that will go onto the pen, and we have a couple of uh, placers here, three placers, six placers. I am not going to use any of these uh, accoutrements. Um, they will go to other places. I love the organza bag with the Treasure Studios Arts logo on that. And of course, oh, my pink tweezers. Who does not love these pink tweezers? They are the blunt tweezers. Let me show you. Blunt, not sharp. Um, there are uses for them. I, I don't use them to pick up the squares. Um, well, actually, I do use them to pick up the squares. I don't use them for diamond painting. I use the sharper ones for the diamond painting. Um, but these are good for picking up the squares if you misplace them and need to move them around because pushing them around the canvas is never a good idea. So, But these bags, oh, they're awesome. What I use these bags for is if I have a drill spill, I will vacuum up the drills, put them in this bag, and wash them and then save them for another time. Um, half the time, I don't get to them. I don't need them. They're extra. They end up being extra. So that is the toolkit. Woohoo! Let me move this out of the way. Let's see what we got. We got garbage. All right. I'm so excited. I love this canvas. Okay, come on, come on. So this is not mounted glue. This is plastic over mounted adhesive, mounting adhesive, and it's wonderful. Um, it is gonna be a little tight, uh, but that's not unusual. So what do you think I'm on? Look, rabbit ears. This is the white rabbit. I'm just undoing it slowly or else it's just gonna bounce right back. To where it was oh my gosh i didn't realize it was so large 50 by 70. look at the eye oh, isn't that amazing okay and it has 35 colors with a schematic here and a schematic down below so let us get to the other let's just get it all unrolled we're going to put the drills off to the side it is already kitted up look Oh, come on. 
pen roll here. Let's just flatten it out a bit. Now, in general, I don't like plastic covers, but the plastic covers that you will find on Treasure Studios Arts paintings, it's a much thicker plastic that goes over this mounted adhesive. So it's great. Just pull it back, put some cover minders on there, and go to town. Now, it does, the mounted adhesive does go past the drill field. So you're going to want to put some washi tape there or else that's going to get dirty. So it is very sticky. Like if you put something down here, you better make sure that's where you want it. Or else, like I said, don't try to slide it around. Oh my gosh, give me my finger. <laughs> um, if you put a drill down by mistake, pick it up with those pink tweezers, put it where you actually want it. Because if you try to slide it there, that is not going to work. Now, her canvases don't have a lot of color to them, the actual canvas. The color is going to come from the drills. But look, he's got his little pocket watch and he's wearing his suit. Oh my God, I love this. Now, the other thing that you will find for Treasure Studios Arts is that whether or not you ordered round or you ordered squares, you're going to get the same canvas, the same 50 by 70 canvas. It is gridded. The grids are a very light, they're not a dark, it's not a dark grid. So, but it is gridded for you when you do your squares. That's why if you're doing rounds, they're only uh, 2.5 centimeters, I think I said that right, instead of larger rounds that you might be used to. But for the squares, perfect. Oh my gosh, so perfect. That way, she can just give the same canvas to everybody, whether it's round or square, and you can work off the same canvas. If you're putting rounds down, you're not going to see that gridding because it is so light. Um, but for the squares, yes, the, the gridding is there. Let's look. Oh my gosh. I'll, I'll put it this way. He's surrounded by blue. There's going to be a lot of blue in this painting. Oh my gosh. So, oh, so pretty. What's going on up here in the sky? Like just um, clouds. Oh yeah. So nice. So, so nice. And I love that she's got the schematic up here and she's got it down here. You know, no matter where you start, there's the schematic. So let's put it this way. Let's take a look at the drills. So yes, this is already kitted up. If you like to work from bags, I do not. Okay, and um, I will tell you that for people, for now, when you get this canvas, you're getting a black and white inventory sheet. That will change in the future. That was a mistake. Um, it is being corrected. So you're going to see a better picture than this black and white picture in the future. But you still got your inventory sheet with the picture, you can take that inventory sheet, run it through your Xyron sticker maker, and um, it's actually a little wide. If you cut, there's four columns, okay? You're gonna see the numbers of the drills, you're gonna see the symbol, the DMC number, and the number of drills that you get. All four columns are not gonna fit through your Xyron sticker maker, nor are three columns, because the sticker maker is just not that wide. So I, oh, I, in, in, in the past, I would take this to my office and shrink it down a little bit. Um, what I may do is just put the symbol and the DNC through the sticker maker. I have to, I am going to have to think about this because I do want to put this on my storage container as a sticker. But this is a little wide, and I will tell Rachel about that, um, that it's too wide for us to cut and put our through our sticker maker. Not a huge big deal. Let's look at the drills. Yeah, I, I actually would like to, I like to do my drills by symbol anyway, so let's go ahead and dump them out. So we do have a lot of blues. I'm, there are 35 colors. I'm going to count them real quick. You will hear music during this portion of the program. Of course, I'm going to do 
this painting. Look, this is probably going to go in his ear. Pink. This is a 602. Let me hold that up so you can see it. Gorgeous. Look, all of this is blue. Blue. Oh my gosh, look at all of these blues that you're getting. 791, 792, 793, 798, 799. These are blues. All blues. And I'm dumping them. <laughs> Let's try that again. They're in these slippery little bags. Let's try that again. Look. <gasps> Beautiful. So gorgeous. Look at uh, these 800s. OMG. Huge. 803. There's no 310 in this, guys. 823. Quite a bit of that. 824. More blues. Look at that. More blues. Even more blues. Getting into the grays here. Oh, for heaven's sakes. <laughs> it is just not cooperating. <laughs> more oh so gorgeous so that's going into the grays we've got some lavender here it's just going to drop more like a soft lavender this is 340 341 i do want to show you those very pretty then we got grays over here 159 160 lots of diamonds oh my gosh i've got lots of diamonds in my future 154 we love 154 i love this color here 917 that's a gorgeous color more pink here 961 then we got this like snowy color that bluish white that's 3756 and not to be you know left out the white 3865 and then some other great colors, more pink, more pink. That's going to be in his ear. I'm, I feel quite confident that this is in his ear. Yeah. So great colors. This I will not get to uh, until I finish my DP Get Your Big On painting. And of course, the other painting that I haven't shown you guys yet. So we're going to put this back. I'm going to put these away, show you the drill field because uh, I'm going to stand up for that. I apologize for not standing for this uh, unboxing, but my knees are just giving me a fit. I have knee surgery scheduled for next week. Woohoo! Yeah, so yeah. <laughs> I'm not taking a, day, a break from diamond painting. Somehow I will, uh, I'll be recuperating and diamond painting at the same time. So those are back in here. Those are going to go over there. This painting I'm going to actually hang up. I do want, to, there's like a whole thing of air there. I want to get that out of the painting. Ah, this plastic, I'm telling you, it is tough. This is not cheap plastic. Oh, I did say drill film. Let's show you the drill film. I'm going to put it up close for you. You want his eyeball? You want his eyeball? Let's show. Let's look at the eyeball. <laughs> if I can get it to the camera. There we go. I just want to show. Here. There's the eyeball. Oh. I need three hands here. All right. Here is the eyeball. And there are the symbols in the eyeball. Let me show you the symbols also up close. Because it's nothing wacky, nothing we haven't seen before. Nothing that we should get too confused about. Again, sorry everybody, I wasn't able to show you the second canvas. Thanks for coming on this journey with me. And I'll see you in the next video.